Hello everybody, Lurgs here, welcome to my channel and today it's how to connect a van battery safely. Plus a top tip at the end, how to keep your battery in good condition. Make sure you follow this video in the exact steps that I'm showing here. Otherwise you may get a spark, you may get a short and you may blow some fuses. So it's very important to do it in the exact correct order. First of all, place the positive terminal on the positive node of the battery, slide that on. Then just tighten that up securely, turning it clockwise until it's nice and tight. Always be careful not to touch your metal tool on the chassis when you're touching the battery terminals. Once it's nice and tight, you can then put the negative cable on the negative node of the battery. Just slide that on nice and quickly. Then take your ratchet and tighten that up clockwise. Nice and tight. Then just check that both cables are nice and tight. And now for the top tip, take some petroleum jelly. Now you can buy special battery paste, but this stuff is good if you haven't got any special battery paste. If you've got rubber gloves, it's a good idea to wear those. I haven't got mine at the moment. And then what you're doing is you're putting the petroleum jelly over the battery terminals. This just helps keep them in really good condition. Do that on the positive terminal as well. Make sure your arm doesn't touch any of the chassis while you're touching any of the terminals. Now I'm just going to clean my finger off with my Silver Surfer boxer shorts. Otherwise my wife is going to want to know why I've got Vaseline on my finger. <laughs> Remember to put any covers over the positive terminal. Most batteries will have a cover which goes over the positive terminal. I'll tell you what, I think that deserves a lovely cup of tea. Oh. Up on the top left, there's a link on how to test your van or car fuses using a multimeter. That means you don't have to remove them. Really good tip. And on the top right hand corner, there's a link on how to test your battery using a multimeter. Thank you. 